Demons, 1985. Thought it was Dario Argento. Apparently, he produced it. And, like, the egotistical motherfucker that he is, he puts his name all over the place. But someone else directed it and uh, watched this movie. And I have no idea what it was about. I, like, spaced out watching it. It was a bunch of nonsense. I think everyone in the world got possessed by demons. And they started foaming at the mouth. They got this cool makeup on. And they started foaming green slime. It was fun in the last act. Like, I pretty much spaced out for the first two acts. I barely remember what happened. But I like that it, instead of being a zombie apocalypse, something you've seen before, it is people possessed taking over the world. And they're very easy to beat. You would think that they'd be more difficult to beat being demonic. But no, the, the last guy, this random asshole, just becomes uh, Arnold Schwarzenegger. And he has a katana. He's driving a motorcycle across the, the movie theater. <laughs> he gets the girl. And it was very entertaining. Entertaining, like, 80s schlock. And it had some great music. Great little 80s music. And then rock music out of nowhere. That's the one thing I like about Dario Argento, even though he didn't make this movie, is that any movie in his association has good music. Like, he, he's the music guy. So, uh... Can I recommend this movie? I don't know. It is weird, entertaining, nonsensical schlock. Uh, there's a guy with a half, like, operatic mask. I thought it was going to end up being a serial killer movie, like a giallo, who's the murderer movie, classic mask killer movie. But it wasn't that. So, yeah. I'm going to give this movie a, a 1.5. Entertaining last act. It could not hold my interest to the point where I, I actively forgot what I was watching. So... Yeah. Demons. What do you think about it? Let me know.